Hello, and welcome to Shimigami Tensei. This is the third one in the series, it is Nocturne, and this is a HD remake. I will be playing this on hard, and it's a challenge. I've played it before on hard and completed it before, but that was back on the PS2. I'll be quiet over the cutscenes, because there is voice acting. Like this one. A world that loses its power will fade into nothing. If such is the fate of this world, then I shall return it to its mother's womb. The world must first die for it to be born again. This is the path to salvation as foretold in an ancient prophecy. The world will fall for its sins, and everyone living will vanish. But I won't let you meet the same fate. I want to help you hold on to your life. To do so, I need to know your name. Will you tell me who you are? Okay. So we are... This. Oh, wrong way. And our given name is Kazuya. I think. Um, there we go. Enter it, eh, eh. Uh, we shall just be known as Kazuya. There we go. Done. Mm. That's right. As of now, your will to live shall sustain you. Believe in it, and survive. Uh, don't understand. You may not understand right now, but please, don't forget what I've told you. I am the nurturer of the next world. The template for our future rests within my hands. Now, I want you to say my name aloud. You are you, Kotakai. That's right. <sighs> no, I won't shed another tear. Not even at this world's end. Instead, I can invite you to the world that is to come. Now go ahead, wake up. The time is here. Okay, we have arrived. Wait, Kazuya, what's the big idea? If we are, we're visiting Mr. Takao today. Just get to Yoga Park ASAP. Time's a wasted. From my classmate. Isami. Real talk, I'd prefer more of a private counselling scenario, but Mr. Takeout is a lot nicer when you're around. Oh, right, be sure to dress to impress. 
After all, you represent me by way of association. How about that slick jacket you bought the other day? Oh, my little demon sprites. Remember, you're just the mood maker. Don't get it twisted, okay? Okay, so. We'll say a goodbye to Mr. Station Master here. Let me guess, you're here for your good park. Ever since that incident went down, it's been one lucky loo after another. No one's here for the train. So, as you could probably tell, I've had a lot of time on my hands. You've heard the news, right? Uh, yeah, I think. Yeah, can't imagine anyone who hasn't. It's all over the airwaves by now. Anyway, sorry to take you off. Probably not something I should be doing on the job. <laughs> right. Okay. We'll get a drink. What should we have? Uh, yeah, let's just pick a random one. What do we get? Oh, I'll list on the machine. Obtained a mysterious drink. So, let's go. Up oh, we go. Exit. Do I want to leave the area? Yes, of course I do. Oh, we are the blue one here, and we want to go to Yo Yogi Park. So, we have to go to this one, and we enter here. Great, the entire park's closed off. They can't even let a guy in to snap a few photos? <sighs> Guess it's not my lucky day. You need something, kid? Not in here. Well, here's what they said on TV. Panic erupts as a clash between corporate representatives and a civic organization ends in violent deaths. Pretty disturbing, right? But those who live on the fringe say... It was a deeper struggle between two cults. One minute, got a call. Uh, I think that's your phone going off. Yeah, I just told you that. Hey, are you there? Yes. Finally, I got a hold of you. What's taking you so long? Yeah, talk to some random person in the park. Shiaki. I could see if it was our other friend, but you're never late. You wake up on the wrong side of the bed? No, I just told you. Where are you now? Yoyogi Park? No, oh, I've gone to Timbuktu. Well, since you decided not to show, we had to leave without you. We're almost there now. Fine. So, yeah, would you mind coming straight to the hospital? Okay. You do know which hospital it is, right? Shinjuku Medical Center. The only one, isn't there? Just go east from Shinjuku Station and keep going. You can't miss it. Hmm, I guess this works out. What does? I was planning to ask our teacher for career advice, so I'll just go ahead of you. Oh, fine. I'll be Thanks. there. Keep in mind, I don't plan on staying too long. Okay, see you later. Hold up. You're on your way to Shinjuku Medical Center? You heard? Hmm. That's also where I'm headed, oddly enough. Go figure. Why don't you hang on to this? It's a copy of our upcoming issue. I'm assuming you don't know what went down here. Then, you probably don't know what kind of place that hospital is either. The name's Hijiri, author of The Ring of Gaia and the Scripture of Moroku. Might want to give that a read. Thank you. Normally, you wouldn't associate a hospital with the occult. That hospital is anything but normal. Or so they say. There's a lot of misinformation floating around these days. If it turns out I'm wrong, just laugh it off, okay? Anyway, I'd better be going. Oh yeah, in the event we run into each other again, let me know how you liked my article. Yeah, will do. 
If I ever run into you. Okay, so. The hospital is up here. And to the right. We can't go in the first door, so... We have to go in the second door here. Shinjuku Medical Center. Hello? Well, hey! About time. Alright. What? Um, is it just me, or is something seriously off here? Yes, it's empty. Hmm. There isn't anyone in sight. No nurses, no patients. I just said, Even the what? reception desk is empty. Don't you think there's something weird about this place? I sure do. Anyway, you know who is looking for our teacher right now. And big surprise, he's still gone. He'd better not be off goofing around. Oh, what's with that magazine? Oh, some random guy in the park gave him me. Do you want it? Some stranger gave it to you? Come on, you should know better than that. Do you want it or not? Ayakashi Monthly. Never heard of it before. What? It's an occult magazine? Why would you bring something like that here? <sighs> well... Maybe it could help me kill some time. Anyway, can you go find that bonehead? Yeah, sure. If he can't find our teacher, then I don't want to be here another minute. You should be on the second floor, where the patients' rooms are. I'll be waiting down here. Oh, and leave the mag with me. Don't leave me hanging too long, okay? Okay. Right, so... Hmm... To the second floor we go! Hmm... I'm a bit thirsty. Should we get another drink? Yeah, sure. What shall I get? I'll get that. Nope. Apparently not. Okay. Let's go this way. Huh. Ah. Someone seems to be near the hall. Okay. scared the crap out of me. Why'd you go sneaking up like that? Yeah, why not? Jeez, you come here late, you cause trouble. You know what? Forget it. Not worth it. I'm sure you've already noticed, but this place has been cleaned out. You think everyone, uh, died off? And it's not reports on the news? I know, called too. our teacher to make sure this was it. She clearly told me. Shinjuku Medical Center. Just relax, it's fine. Of course, could happen. Dude, the world ended. How are you not freaking out? I'm getting some super negative vibes right now. I've already checked out everywhere she might be. I'm running out of places to look. Think we should just call it? All right, I'm gonna head back down and check out how our other lady's doing. I bet she's all pissed because I've been gone so long. <sighs> it ain't easy pleasing a princess. Anyway, I really hope this isn't the shitstorm it's shaping up to be. Well, let's hope not. Let's uh, head on down. I just walk past the elevator. No. 
could go up past the stairs now. Then we'll take the stairs down. Why not? Oh. That's not the stairs. Uh, let's go back and just take the elevator. Where's the elevator? There it is. Okay. And we're going down to the first floor. So, off we go. They better be here. Oh. Where is it? Oh, you're back. So, you know that special report at the beginning of the magazine? Well, it says some things that are more than a little unsettling. According to this, there's a group of demon worshippers who call themselves the Ring of Gaia, and they're right here in Japan. Apparently, they believe in this book of prophecy called the Scripture of Miroku. In that book, it says that chaos will engulf the world, and these people are trying to cause that somehow. Whether their idea of chaos means terrorism or something else entirely, the reporter couldn't figure that out. But get this. Well, uh, no luck finding her. I even checked the men's room. Ugh, didn't need to know that. We're in the middle of a conversation here, so save those details for later. Now, listen to this part. A hospital on the east side of Shinjuku is closely linked to the organization's sinister plan. Let me guess. That ends with... Find out more in our next issue. Though it wouldn't surprise me if that article had some truth to it. I've heard some real spooky shit about this place. Like how they run deadly experiments on patients. Or how a psychic started shrieking and bolted out of here. Sounds fun. And of course, there's a rumor that a cult's behind it all. You're serious? I never knew any of that. Maybe we really shouldn't have come here. Bit like now. I almost feel stupid for buying into some bizarre tabloid, but it does get one thing right. How creepy this hospital is. Mm-hmm. We really need to find her, don't we? Okay, we search this place top to bottom one last time. If nothing pops up, we assume nothing's wrong, and we split. By the way, Looks like you can reach the annex from the second floor. I'll go take a look up there. Whereas you have the honor of searching the basement. Oh, and uh, you'll need this. You're the one who found the card. Why don't you search the basement? Could it be you're too scared? Come on, this is me we're talking about. The only reason he's going is because I'm sure there's nothing down there. Look, all you need to do is confirm that our teacher isn't in the basement. Got it? After all, saving the day is my job. Should things take a turn for the worse, just run like hell, okay? I can't believe him sometimes. Anyway, let's focus on finding our teacher. No matter what, we have to make sure she's safe. I agree. But do you really think she's in the basement? What could possibly go wrong with that, hey? Well, in the next episode, I'll go into the basement. So, I will see you then. Goodbye.